Hello dear viewers, welcome back to the channel Basic Home First Aid. Today I am going to show you how to apply Basic First Aid after a snake bite. Did you know that snakes are found on every continent except the Antarctica? Leave a comment about this at the end of the video. Before we continue, subscribe to this channel and click on the notification bell to know when we release new videos. You are scared of a snake, right? Don't worry, you are not the only one. Most human beings are afraid of snakes. A snake bite is not usually serious. However, it is safer to assume every snake is venomous if a person has been bitten. A venomous bite is often painless. Depending on the snake, the venom may cause local tissue destruction, it may block nerve impulses causing breathing and heart to stop or cause blood clotting and internal bleeding. Some examples of venomous snakes include vipers, black mambas, cobras and puff adders. Do not attempt to kill or capture the snake that beat the casualty, but if possible, make a note of the appearance to help the doctor find the correct antivenom. Take precautions to avoid other people being bitten. The first eight principles for treating any kind of snake bites are the same. A patient who has been bitten will have the following signs or symptoms. A pair of puncture marks which may be painless, severe pain, swelling and redness at the bite site, nausea and vomiting, disturbed vision, increased salivation and sweating, labored breathing and all this may stop altogether. Our aims to approach such a casualty will be to prevent venom from spreading and to arrange urgent transfer of the patient to the hospital. Help the casualty to lie down with health and shoulders raised. Reassure the casualty and advise her not to move the beaten limb to avoid the venom from spreading. Remove any jewelry from the area that was beaten. Wrap a pressure bandage around the entire length of the limb that was beaten. The bandage should be comfortably tight and loose enough to allow a finger to be slipped under it. Whether or not it is wrapped, the limb should be immobilized with a splint to prevent the casualty from bending it. Keep the limb below the level of the heart. Transport the casualty to the hospital as soon as possible. Cautions: Do not apply a tourniquet, slash the wound with a knife or try to suck out the venom. Also, do not apply ice or water on the wound. Thank you for watching, hope it helps someone out there. Don't forget to click on the subscription button and never forget this, if not you, who?